Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television GPTV. I'm right in my hands. This is Ultimate Black Panther number three. Uh, this has been a really interesting series, especially when kind of considering how it compares to the other Ultimate comics. It's written by Brian Hill, art by Stefano Caselli, color by David Serial, lettering by Corey Petit. Uh, so, it, it is, out of the three comics, this was, I think, the one that is m closest to the source material. It's closest to tr traditional Black Panther. Uh, what we have here, though, is is Kanchu and Ra have teamed up and are threatening uh, Wakanda. Um, T'Challa is now in uh, in charge of the nation. He's married. He has a queen. Um, there seems to be some internal strife. Some people are working against his rule. Uh, the question is, who can he trust? Who can't he trust? And he decides to head out into uh, where he thinks the enemy is. And he comes across two interesting characters, Killmonger and Storm, who will be taking him kind of deeper into the mystery. And that's what this issue is. It's been a few weeks since uh, T'Challa has left uh, his kingdom. Uh, that has caused some instability and strife between certain characters. So that interaction, I think, is really good. But uh, T'Challa talking to Killmonger and what he's shown, I think, is more intriguing. Like, I got to the end, and I have no idea what's what's being um, revealed. So I think this is the issue where the series really starts to, like, differ from uh, the source material. And it's going to be interesting to see what, what was revealed and what it winds up being. Uh, I mean, to me, it, the closest this is coming out is, like, I get the same vibe as I get the Transformers comics in that... Uh, it starts off very familiar, uh, with some slight differences to what it is riffing off of, uh, but slowly with each issue it is planting a flag of its own and, uh, and differentiating itself. And that way it, it's, it's good, like it's not a bad thing at all. Uh, it's, it's intriguing, like I'm, I, I really want to see where it goes. Uh, and find out what the hell is discovered at this point. Um, art, I think, continues to be fantastic. Uh, it, it really does a, a more grounded high-tech vibe than uh, the Marvel 616 uh, Black Panther, and I think that's maybe one issue that I have with Black Marvel's Black Panther 616 is that it's almost too futuristic. Uh, this There's high-tech in here, but it also feels more grounded or more like worked into society, if that makes sense. Um, the tech doesn't quite stand out as much, even though it's it's very very present. Uh, so overall, like I'm I'm really intrigued just to see where this all goes. There's there's a nice like political undertone to everything, and and you don't know who to trust and where it's all gonna, you know what's going to happen next. Um, I fully expect like a coup at some point. So this is this is going to be interesting. Uh, you can go get this is out in shops. We got a link beneath this video. Put in your zip code. It'll tell the shops near you. No shop, no problem. We have some links where you can purchase your own. There'll be affiliate links, so you get a small percentage. And by doing that, you help support our site. Support our site. So thank you for that. And speaking of support, just watch your video support us as always. So thank you. Uh, if you're into comics, check us out every single day at graphicpolicy.com. We're on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Tumblr, Instagram, TikTok, Mastodon, Threads, Blue Sky, all at Graphic Policy, keeping it nice and consistent. Until next time, keep reading those comics and keep it geeky. Hey, thanks for watching the previous video from Graphic Policy Television. Just by watching, you help support our site. Thank you so much. Now, if you're watching these videos, you probably care about geeky things like movies, television, comic books, toys, games, video games, you name it. You can go and subscribe right now to our YouTube channel to stay in touch and catch all the new videos, or check out our website at graphicpolicy.com. There's a nice link on this end of the video. But as always, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking and keep it geeky.